everyone. Hi everyone. Welcome back to the channel and yet another video. Um, as you can see from the title, uh, Caravan to Motorhome, was it the right decision? Hmm. We've now had the Motorhome uh, a few months, been out in it quite a lot. Still comparing the Motorhome to the Caravan. Uh, as you know, before we had a coachman, uh, twin axle, 26 foot long, loads of open space, we knew there'd be a compromise with uh, the motorhome, which we yeah. knew we were going to be, uh, so we were prepared for that. Was it the right decision? We're still undecided, to be honest with you. Yeah. We we are sort of umming and ahhing uh, what to do. Still thinking we might have made the wrong decision. Yeah. We are, as we speak, looking at other vehicles, uh, caravans, not ruling, going back to a caravan, not ruling out motorhomes, but we are looking at other other things as well because, unfortunately, this motorhome, we made the wrong decision. So, we're, like I said, we're looking at other, other vehicles. We're going tomorrow to a couple of dealers tomorrow, uh, just to have a look round and see what there is yeah. but like I said we we like I said we knew we were going to compromise but yeah. this is just a bit of a, too much of a compromise as I said we wanted a, a side dinette which we've now got in this vehicle um, we decided on the lounge we decided on the lounge which we've got here which we've got the rear lounge yeah it's got the drop down bed so we thought we'd use that couldn't but, really couldn't really get on with it did we to be honest with you, because yeah. uh, getting during the coming down during the night, one's got to climb over the other one to get in there, which we didn't really think about. Uh, yeah, and it's say dangerous as well during the night. Yeah, during the night, yeah. Trying to negotiate a ladder, um, but also lack of storage. Yeah, we come quite not inside. Yeah, that's outside. Yeah, you know what I mean. It's got lots of cupboards and everything else. Yeah, and it has got lots of storage, of but. Yeah, putting anything in there anywhere yeah. it's a nightmare yeah, so we've already had to change our um, seating yes. chairs for sitting outside because we can't get them in anywhere to get some slightly smaller ones which yeah. we were all right doing because we've done the other ones like four years anyway but um, yeah. like I said there's been a lot of compromise so we've decided no this motorhome isn't for us so, like I said, and now it's a decision whether we go back to caravanning or whether we keep. Yeah, I'll, I'll stay with motorhome. Go, I mean. go to another motorhome. Because we, we, we have, have to admit we do like the motorhome in life. Yeah, yeah, we do. But we also like the caravan in life as well. And we like both. It's, yeah, and it's like people said, uh, coming over to the dark side, it's totally different to caravanning completely. Is it yeah. too much of a compromise? And a change, who knows? Yeah, but it's two different. It's two different yeah. aspects. It's isn't two it? different aspects completely. Car, you, caravanning is okay if you stay at places for a long time. That's what we found. Yeah. Which we did. That's what we did. But then we wanted to just do, do weekends away yeah. and you know try that. And it was the best thing for it was a motor. Motor home. Yeah, that's right. And we really enjoyed that. But then we realised, whoa, wait a minute we go for weeks away or we still want to go for weeks, weeks away. away yeah and it was like where do we put the awning where do we put the windbreak where do we put this where yeah. do we put that you without, know without having everywhere cluttered so we didn't want this all filled in the lounge area the, yeah you know because then it then it uh comprehends you know having a motor room compromises compromises yeah. Yeah, yeah compromises, compromises. Yeah, that's it yeah having a motor room because you've still got all the stuff about and then where yeah. do you put it when you get to when you get to the site, site you know what I mean you so, know what I mean you, you're putting it up but if you can't put it up that night because for some whatever reason yeah. which we've got to sites before and you, you've not been able to put it because it's been pouring down the rain, rain it's, or it's too been dark. dark too dark yeah and yeah. then it's like well are we going to have to stand on the awning and so this yeah, is yeah we didn't really give that much thought no. I must admit and we actually use the lounge as two singles rather than making up the bed because we can't yeah. get on with the drop down bed so yeah, so we've like actually said, come we've, to these now we've actually you know made a mind up that you know this motor room wasn't the right decision and we are gonna yeah. start looking so anyway come along with us yeah yeah come along with follow us. follow our journey 
who knows what yeah. we're going to end up with. See what we decide. Yeah. Until later, we'll see. Bye for now. Bye for now. Bye.